Rich Robin here, Gator Pit of Texas, Custom Barbecue Pits in Houston, Texas. We're going to go through the shop here and see what we got going on right now. Uh, I know we have a big rig that we're designing or designed, and now we're building it for next year. And let's see what we got going on with that trailer right now. It is a custom trailer, and we have built it from the ground up. We have a big boy, meat slinger going on it right there, man. That is a dual hopper, 24 by 60, wide cut, single door counterweighted, with shacks going through the roof, with dual pellet pro hoppers on one on each end. So dual hoppers, one on each end, one on the rear, and one's going to go on the front over there. We built our own trailers. We designed our own trailers. This one's uh, sitting on tandem, 3,500 pound. Uh, these are shop wheels on it, but it will have some nice custom 225 radial trailer rated tires on there again these are just our shop wheels we don't mess up those pretty wheels got our gator pit welder right there up underneath it attaching the big boy pellet grill and you see how tall those stacks are because they're going through the roof and they will have dampers on them to adjust them as well on a pellet grill basically the adjustments just opening them up not like an offset smoker this also has a Custom made Gator Pit grill attached. That is your grill. It is a 24 by 48 grill. You can see how beefy this trailer is. Potential weak points on trailers are reinforced with quarter inch thick steel gussets. This one's quarter inch thick by two inches, and it's where the trailer toes in towards the V shaped tongue. That is a stress point. You can see how we have seriously beefed that area up so you don't have to worry about any stress fracturing going down the highway bouncing if it bounces on a pothole or road it won't stress and fracture on you gator pit welders are the best welders in the industry man i'm telling you these guys are good at what they do We've got a bulldog type coupler that is a two inch with a top line trailer jack and a removable wheel. The front deck will be solid plate. There's your charcoal grill. Wide cut door, counterweighted as well. Slide vents, drains, stainless steel handles, gauges. We'll have gator gauges on it. And here's that big boy pellet. There's going to be a hopper there, be a little open space right here for a little table area. There are electric brakes on this tandem, and again, designed by Gator Pit and built by Gator Pit. We built all our own trailers. That's what's happening there. Let's see what I got on going on over here. We've got uh, some shipping going on. Getting this one crated to the ship. This is a Gator Pit Hybrid. It has the offset, uh, I'm sorry, offset firebox there. We have the pellet hopper over here. It cooks with real wood logs in an offset firebox, or you can fire up the pellet hopper side as well. It's got a two inch drain, and you can see we custom crate them. We have to build our own pallets, build our own crates to fit these custom cookers. They don't fit anything standard because they're not standard. We protect everything. You can see there the hopper is being protected. And there will be a wall built all the way around this. It will be crated. Over here, meat slinger being built right now. This meat slinger is available. Whoever wants it, call an order right now. That's all this welder right here builds. Only builds meat slingers. And he builds them all day long, five days a week, eight hours a day. All he does is build meat slingers. That's why they're so good. Got your grease pans, your heat shields. This one's going to have five sliding meat racks, and it will be the hybrid. It will have the offset firebox attached to it as well. You want this meat slinger? Order it right now, 713 896 0144. 713 896 0144. He's putting in the heat shield right now. These heat shields are all 11 gauge thick. They're thick, thick, thick heat gauges, um, uh, heat shields, and grease pans. We use the Smoke Daddy Pellet Pro Hoppers on here with the upgraded 
uh, uh, Elite upgraded stainless steel components. Casters. We use the best casters in the industry. I, these are guys by far. These beat all, pretty much all my competitors' casters. They use little tiny old casters, even on their big pits. These little tiny swivels. These aren't tiny swivels. These are five, six, and eight inches. Foot brakes, grease zerks, bearings. Yeah. Beefy wheels. They're all weather. Go look at my pre previous video of me taking a, a sledgehammer to one of these and hitting it like a golf ball multiple times across my parking lot at my shop. The caster never broke. It still functions, still worked. Brakes still locked. Still spun. You're not going to abuse those like I did, but that's how I test a lot of my products, man. I put them through the ringer. I put them through my test. Let's see what we got over here. Stacking them up for shipping. We got what looks like a party gator right there. We got another hybrid right here. That's a hybrid 24 Texas Premier 2. Hanley Hideaway. Custom artwork. Yes, we do. We have a porch mate CNC plasma table, five by ten, a big table. We can cut what you want. Here is a backyard classic on my website with a counterweight added to it. And we have what looks like a party gator out there with a grill firebox, something a little unique. That's pollen on here, y'all. That's not what it looks like. It's just got pollen on it. That top shelf removes, and you have an access to a grill door in there. All right, so you can grill in your firebox. Some of them call it a cowboy grill. It's a grill firebox. It's all the same stuff. It does have a sliding meat rack in there. Get you another shot of these here. Gator pit's busy, guys. Welders are welding. Shippers are shipping. Check this out. Show you how custom we are. We even make our own burners. That's a three burner right there. Fixing to get installed on that trailer I just showed you. It's got flip griddles. These griddles fold and lock back in place. You can see the locking mechanisms there. They lock there. So you can use them as a standard burner. Put your fish fry pots on top. Turkey fryer, uh, turkey pots on top, whatever you want. If you want to griddle bacon, eggs, and whatever else you want to grill in there, throw some tortillas on there, fold that griddle top down. You got it. We make these. We don't buy them. We make them. Can't buy this. Can't buy that quality. Can't buy, buy that, that thick steel like that. You can't buy this unless you get it through Gator Pit. Here's one Meat Slinger 36 hybrid. It's got based it off of my personal Meat Slinger 36 hybrid. Down to the flag. Red, white, and blue. Bald Eagle inside. American Eagle. And you can see the crating around it. Protect it. You can see the styrofoam we put where the hopper is. Protect the hopper. Up on the stack. Wrapped it in stretch wrap. All to keep from getting damaged during shipping. New steel, guys. We only use new steel. This is all brand new steel. Plate, tubing, angle. Even the pipe is brand new. And some say, well, look at all that rust on it. It's pipe. It sits out in a pipe yard, y'all. All that gets stripped completely down to the bare metal. More over here. More pipe, angle, flat bar, round bar. We got it all here, guys. Got it all. Custom meat racks. Let me walk over here and show you that. We make our own meat racks. We don't buy them from a restaurant supply company that go in an oven and put them in a cooker that we make. We buy our own. We, we buy the steel that you saw out there and we turn them into our own meat racks to fit our pits. There's some parts. There's your hoppers. Just giving you a little quick tour through my shop, y'all. 
Anybody want a carnivore? This one is available. Got some shop dust on it, but it is brand spanking new and it is available. Call me. 713-896-0144. And now we're mounting that burner. So all the cooking apparatuses are getting mounted on the trailer, put in place, and then we're going to come back and build around all that. So you get your solid plate deck there. There'll be some expanded metal in there. There's going to be a huge, huge stainless steel table that goes back behind this that goes the full length from the burner all the way down to the end of the trailer. And there's a generator mount back there going to go in there as well for a little 2K generator. Get on back out here. I'd show you my rental pits, but all three of my rental pits are gone this weekend. All three Falcons have been rented. If you need a pit for your event, mobile, call Gator Pit of Texas. Ask for Rich. We have rentals available. We have three mobile trailers that are available for rent. You can go to our website at GatorPit.net and see those. You can see our rental agreements. You can see what it costs for the weekly, daily, and weekend rental rates. Want a Gator Pit, but you want to try one out first? We'll rent one of our pits. If you like it, place your order on one. If you don't like it, I don't want to tell you. I'm Rich Robin, Gator Pit of Texas Custom Barbecue Pits. See ya.